Hello Star Riders, welcome to this brand new video. Today I'm going to show you my Dino Valley archaeology route. So, um, basically, uh, this is only for the red dinosaur because that's the one I need to finish. And I felt like sharing my route because I know that this particular dinosaur can be really annoying. Uh, so yeah, this route, I know it's kind of complicated, but I feel like the one that I've got is probably um, the easiest one to follow in a way but the easiest one to like remember at least that's the easiest one for me so I hope that you'll be able to kind of follow along and memorize it uh, so I might be digging some spots because I really need that freaking dino anyway this should cover every single dig spot hopefully and we are starting um, so basically, at the end of the ice forest, in uh, the Valley of the Frozen Mist. I believe that's what it's called. I think so. Uh, basically, so when you come up the little forest thingy, you come here for a quest. So hopefully you'll have done that. Otherwise, there's many videos that show how to get there. So just look it up, come back here. And yeah, we're gonna begin. So basically, uh, you're gonna go through this rock and this tree. And you are gonna come uh, down here first, which there is a stone right here. So that's right on the right. Right on the right, that's pretty funny. Um, right on the right when you enter. So that's the first rock. And then we'll go to this rock formation, and there will be another one right here behind it. So that's the second one. And then I'm gonna go around this ice pillar in the back, and there will be another stone right here go and then this one is kind of tricky i haven't really found any video that explains it really but what you want to do is uh there's the frozen tree and it's basically going to be like in front of the frozen tree but at a certain distance there it is um so as you can see we're in front of the frozen tree between bushes so this is uh the fourth i believe spot then we're gonna go forward towards the frozen tree and near the ramp, you'll actually have uh, another stone right here. What I like to do here is actually go up the bushes through, um, yeah, through basically the bushes and up that ramp. Now I try to stay as close to the wall as possible. Otherwise, your horse, there you go. It kind of stops like this because of the weird terrain. And this leads us up to another rock right here. Then I'm gonna go down the ramp, through the bushes, and there's another one next to the portal, and I actually used to always skip that one. Uh, so, boom, it's there, and it's right here. So it's in between the bushes, it's kind of easy to miss, but it's right next to the portal. So once we got that one, we're gonna go through the forest. As you can see, there are kind of a, there, there are two like fallen trees, and we're gonna go forward. There's two trees right next to one another, kind of in between those two fallen trees and this is where you get this rock then you're going to go down to the other rock formations that's a lot of rocks <laughs> and there's another spot right here I'm gonna go around oh well okay you'll see that this is pretty common you'll probably run into trees as well uh, I can't help it you know I just love trees uh, so we're gonna have the other spot right here and I actually have something hope for bones you'll see that you actually get a lot of trash when you do this for some reason especially with the um, i believe this is spectacular dino you mostly get trash and rarely get bones so yeah that makes it really painful to actually finish anyway after this one we're gonna go forward and we're actually gonna go in between right here where we have another rock right here now we're gonna go through and up this can be a little tricky sometimes because your horse doesn't really want to climb but we're gonna go forward and there will be a fallen tree right here and right behind it we actually have another rock once you got that one we're gonna go through the trees and up to this fallen tree right here and we're gonna go right under it and up the ramp now up the ramp there will be another dick spot right here and if we look right below there's another one as well now for some reason i never get anything down to this one but you know that may just be my luck. Now we're gonna go through uh, this ice thing, and there is another one right in the middle. We're gonna go through again, and we are going to go along the vault. So the vault is actually in a story quest, so if you've done it, you know where it is. We're gonna go through, and there is another big spot right here. 
Okay, this can be this can be a little tricky. So basically from here you're gonna go through those two trees right here. You're gonna go down, stick close to the wall, and you'll find the other one. Once you've got that one, we're gonna go straight down to through the trees, the trees. And um there's our first rock that you're gonna see, you wanna go past that one. And you wanna go to the second rock. And the second rock on the back you'll actually find the other dig spot. Now from here, that's kind of the easy part. You just go down here and you're gonna have another rock right here. There you go. Turn onto your left, continue forward, and right in front of the bridge, you'll have another dig spot. And I actually have something. Alright. We're gonna see. Hopefully we'll get bones. Let's see. Okay, it's a bone, but not the type of bone we want. So once you've gotten that one, we're gonna go to the last rock in my route, which is here, and there you go, and that is your last rock. So that's the route that I take, um, ooh, 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 no, I do not want to call for pickup. So that's the route that I take, I hope it was helpful, and if I'm missing any rocks, just let me know down below, because that would actually be really helpful. Uh, I hope that this could also be helpful to you, and I wish you luck on your archaeology adventures. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye!